Oh, what's up, crew? It's Marsh. We'll come to you guys and girls raw with an unboxing video. Um, this one's from my friend George, George Aikard of GI Custom Knives, and uh, it's one. Boy, we're talking. I'd have to go back and see, but man, this is a knife that's that's been uh, old for a long time. Uh, man, I can't even think. Two years, maybe. I'd have to go back. You know, I won his contest with the with the design that I did uh, back when I was. Uh, diligently and proficiently studying uh, knife arts. I had came up with a design that I actually seeked out more than one person to build for me. It's a very, very difficult, difficult design. And uh, long and short of it, George, George said, "Yeah, I can do it. Uh, I'd love to give it a shot." Well, it you know, obviously proved a, a little bit hard, but George said, "You know what? I'm not failing." I'm going to build what I can, you know, and I'm excited to see. Um, I hope hope you guys, girls, are also. What I'm going to use to open this box up is something that just came out of its second acid and stone wash. Let's get you guys, girls, underneath the the lights. Felt like destroying something pretty today. So I got the. This is the second cycle with acid and stone wash on the collaboration blade between myself and Jester0916. Check out that. Deep, deep. Beautiful color, and it has that nice reflection, even though it's acid and stone wash because it was a mirror finish before. Just a few things I'm not really, really happy with. Like, must have been something right there, you see? It didn't come out 100% the way I like it. So, we're gonna do it over probably another two, maybe three cycles. But we're gonna use it. Check it out. There you go. You can pause it and get his information if you need it. Oh, there's no fun in popping this. I have no idea what this stuff is. Let's see, I'm gonna take my gloves off. Watch your feet. Now we're definitely redoing that ass wash. <coughs> hey. Oh, look at that presentation, huh?
well done. Get the show on the road here. What do you guys and girls think? Well, there you go. Hey everyone, hope your uh, your day's blessed. I had a day filled of uh, of uh, Christmas parties, and if uh, you know, like like always, if uh, <laughs> if you uh, need uh, George Ickard's uh, YouTube number number. Ding dong, I'm burnt out. If you need George's uh, information, it'll be down in the description below. And uh, if you don't know about George, take a look at his channel. Quality people. A nice man, even if, you know, don't get me wrong me saying that this is this is, took a, a long time for him to do. It's because, first and foremost, it's a very difficult build. I know. Um, so... For now, everyone, thank you so much for your time. Huge, huge respect. And uh, I really greatly appreciate you coming along for another another journey. I will, <coughs> hopefully in these these uh, next few days I get off, I'll finish up um, the collaboration blade. Get some handles on there. <coughs> Excuse me so much for that. Sorry about that. What's up, crew? Finish this Back up. my old ways, forgetting how to put the phone on airplane mode so I don't get interrupted by a phone call. But it was valuable, and um, uh, what I'll do is I'll splice one and two if I can figure it out and make it anew. But uh, as I was saying, just in case, uh, when I splice them together, I make sure I get everything done. In the upcoming days I have off, I'm going to try to pound out um, the collaboration blade get into watchmaker and jeweler uh, as soon as possible so I can hopefully get engraved before Christmas. Uh, you know, begging pre please with sugar on top. So, uh, hopefully we'll get that done so you guys can come along for the journey. I am thinking because, you know, it's one of those, those knives that kind of speaks for itself. Awesome defensive blade. Um, you know, it, it's going to be utilitarian. Now I have it with the utilitarian finish on there. What better than to put on some Phantom Gaikata. This is the Phantom Paper Gaikata too. Uh, I may use the paper. I also <coughs> found a canvas. You can see the, the granular difference. I think I may use paper. And I'm going through tubes. I'm going to uh, chamfer and flare and <coughs> go that route. Because um, that's what I'm kind of feeling. I'm kind of feeling it. So, uh, everyone, thank you so much for your time. 
Man, I really appreciate you coming along. I hope everyone's Christmas is absolutely fantastic. And if you don't celebrate, I hope your uh, rest of your month is absolutely boss because you deserve it. So for now, oh, by the way, I'm like at 44 degrees today. Nice. Out. Can't even see my breath. <laughs>